Tanganani traditional arts and music cultural celebrations take place today at the Tulamaashi Stadium in Bushbuck Ridge, um, Pumalanga. Now the celebrations will feature some of the country's finest traditional music performers and various cultural exhibition showcases. Now to talk to us a little bit more about these celebrations and what uh, is going to happen today, we're speaking to, uh, we've got King Chauke from um, Pumalanga Studios, who's the organizer of the event. He's also got one of the artists performing at the event. So good morning welcome to morning live morning live and morning to all the viewers speak to us about the Tanganani traditional arts and music uh, celebrations what are these give us background into the celebrations uh, Lebu, thanks for the opportunity but uh, if I may put it this way the annual Tanganani traditional music and art celebration um, it was started to uplift and celebrate our diversity cultures and also embracing our four brothers around the African continent. That's why the event also embraces uh, some of the African finest traditional artists. Mm -hmm. uh, speak to us about the artist that's sitting next to you, you know, let him introduce himself and tell us you know, what we can look forward to. Uh, the artist that I'm sitting next to is one of the most um, wanted uh, one of the most selling artists in the Tsonga tradition in the name of Benny Maingani. All right. Benny, what can artists, uh, people attending the celebrations look forward to from you? All right. Seems Benny can't hear us. So um, why was it important to celebrate uh, this music? Um, if I may put it this way, Lev, again, that um, a lot of our upcoming generations, they seem to be losing the plot in terms of our culture, our heritage, and our tradition. And this is one of the events that is trying so hard to, to put back that culture of Ubuntu, to give the lessons that our forefathers have laid for us. Mm -hmm. Now, how has the event grown since its inception? Uh, the event have grown. If um, I might remind a lot of people that in the last year in Duende we hit about um, a 13,000 crowd, and today in Tulamahashi we are expecting not less than 10,000 crowd. So the event have grown in leaps and bounds, and I would like to say thanks to the Department of Arts and Culture, thanks to their support, and thanks to them making sure that the event grows. Mm -hmm. Now, give us um, a, an idea of what is on the lineup. Uh, people remember the best Kwasa Kwasa Kanda Bongoman from DRC, Mr. Bauer from Mozambique, uh, we got Benny Maengani, we got Joe Shirimani, um, we got Cultural Spears from Botswana, we got Zozo from Zimbabwe. Um, so, the event it promises to be one of the best that Mpumalanga have never seen in mm. decades gone. Yeah. Now, having been part of the project for so long, what have been the highlights for you of being part of this project? Uh, the highlight of the project will be how many youth have supported this initiative. When we started, we never expected a lot of youth, but I can tell you today, our L LSM have changed mm -hmm. a lot of youth are the people that are currently attending these events. And it shows how they missed such initiatives. Mm -hmm. Now, what did you see in the market that, that necessitated these kind of celebrations? Um, you know, I used to drive, as somebody who grew up in Soweto, I used to drive past and all I could hear was Kwaito house and a bit of hippo by then. And when we came up with the initiative, it was after I drove and then I had one of the most talented young boys that I didn't know by the name of Benny Maingani. And that was 2011. And when I approached him and I saw how youth embraced his music, I decided to say, maybe the youth, they want to engage with our cultures and tradition, mm. but they don't know where to go. And the initiative was well received by the Department of Arts and Culture. And when we started the initiative, it was all about celebrating our heritage.
All right, King Chauke, good luck with the celebrations today. Thank you so much for speaking to us. King Chauke is the organizer of the Hlanganani traditional art and music celebrations that are set to take place today in Bushbuck Ridge. Uh, so if you're uh, there in that area, Tula Maashi Stadium is the place where the uh, celebrations take place. Well, let's take a break. Stay with us.